I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and God has called and commissioned me to preach the good news of the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ. My dear friend, I encourage you as I share a message with you and I pray for you today. Be in agreement, connect in faith, believe and you shall receive in the name of Jesus. Hello and welcome to this special video brought to you by GFM United Prayer and Revival Ministry Studios. It is so good to be with you today. It is Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez here and I greet you in the wonderful name of Jesus, the name above all names, the one who brings healing, the one who brings deliverance, the one who has brought our salvation, the first and the last, the Alpha and the Omega, the one who was and is and is to come, Jesus the Christ, our Lord and Savior. You can be rest assured and you can find comfort in Jesus. You can find comfort in his presence. You can find comfort in what he has made available to us, even this day. My dear friend, as I had announced the week before last week that on Saturday we will be praying special healing prayers. We are continuing with that. Uh, last week, Saturday, we skipped on the healing prayers because I had a special word that I needed to deliver to you. Wherever you are trusting God and you are believing for healing in your body, God is able to do it. God is able to heal you. God is able to deliver you. God is able to set you free. And God is able to set you up on solid rock, on a firm foundation, and give you good health. So even as we begin to pray, take yourself and your device where you're watching me from. Just go somewhere private where you can pray, where you can seek God, where you can press in, and nobody will disturb you, where you can receive your healing. And even as you go there, in your own words, begin to express to God how much He means to you. Begin to praise Him in your own words. Father, we just praise You and we thank You for another day that You've given us. It is another opportunity. It is a day to live to the fullest. It is by Your grace and by Your mercy that we can press on. It is by Your grace and by Your mercy that we are still here today to press in and to seek You again. We give You praise and thank You. You mean a lot to us, Lord. You mean the world to us. You are our Creator, the first and the last, the one who was and is and is to come. You are our God who makes a way where there seems to be no way. And even today you're making a way for my dear friend who's watching this video, my dear friend, dear, dear son, my dear friend, dear, dear daughter, wherever my dear friend might be. Distance and time is not a barrier for you. Right now, if my dear friend is watching this video and my dear friend is anxious and I thank you and I give you praise that you're giving my dear friend relief right now. And my dear friend shall go up and not down in the name of Jesus Christ. It is by your grace and by your mercy that we can press on. And it is by your grace and by your mercy that we can keep on going. I give you praise and thank you for the full and finished work of the cross that guarantees our salvation that guarantees our blessing, that guarantees our healing. I thank you for the full and finished work of the cross that makes a way so that my dear friend who's watching this video can receive the healing even today. So even today as we pray, begin to touch, begin to change, begin to heal, begin to deliver my dear friend. Heal my dear friend of all infirmity, of all sickness, whatever symptom or whatever feeling my dear friend might be feeling. Heal, my dear friend. There is no ailment that is too great for you not to fix and not to heal. Heal, my dear friend, and do what only you can do in my dear friend's life. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. My dear friend, I discern God's presence, and I know, like I know, as we pray, God is going to bless you. Be expectant. Believe for your miracle. Trust God. And believe in Jesus. Jesus is the one who makes a way where there seems to be no way. There is no one else who makes a way apart from Him. He makes a way for us in those areas where man can't help us. He makes a way for us in those areas where there is no solution. And even in times like this, I trust, know and believe for all his children, he shall make a way. So be encouraged, believe in God, trust him, and he shall make a way for you. So in saying that, let us begin. As we go into a time of prayer, I want to encourage you to do three things. The first and the most important is just welcome the Holy Spirit. Say this out loud. Say, Holy Spirit of God, I welcome you. Come, Lord Holy Spirit, and take over control. Help me to pray. Help me to press in today. Help me to receive from the Father. Do what only you can do. Touch me, change me, heal me, deliver me, set me free, and take me to a greater glory. Do this for the glory of King Jesus. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. My dear friend, the second thing that I want to encourage you to do is be in agreement. Let us connect in faith. Let us believe and agree together 
and God will do something mighty. Even if you're watching this video and you don't need healing, but it's healing for someone else, a friend, or someone else who's going to watch this video, connect in faith, believe, let us trust God together for healing and deliverance. Because I truly believe, even in this time period, there is a healing anointing that is being released on many. And even right now, if you're trusting God for that grace, receive it in Jesus' name. So connect in faith, comment down below in the comment section and agree, and God will bless you. The third thing, if you've got a prayer request and you want me to pray with you and for you, simply go to my website, go to www.gabrielfernandezministries.org and click on daily prayer list. Fill in your prayer request, click submit, it'll come through to me and I'm going to trust God with you. But in saying that, let us begin. Father, right now, I pray in the name of Jesus. Release the grace for healing. Release the grace that my dear friend will be healed, body, soul and spirit. That my dear friend will be restored of all things that my dear friend has lost because of hurt, because of pain, because of physical sickness in their body. Begin to touch my dear friend and meet my dear friend at their point of need. Wherever my dear friend is trusting you for healing, let a healing begin to take place. Wherever my dear friend is trusting you for deliverance from infirmity, let deliverance from infirmity take place. Wherever my dear friend is trusting you to receive the grace to be able to pray for other people and they be healed, give my dear friend the grace so that they can pray and be the salt and light in this world. I pray this in Jesus' name. Father, release your grace in Christ and the power to bring a mighty healing right now. Bring a healing that only you can bring and change the situation completely. Change that health report and that health check so that it gives a good report. Father, turn the situation around completely that the doctors will look back and be astonished and be amazed and wonder how did this happen and say and admit that this can only be God. Father, I thank you for the move that you are bringing about, even in these times of trouble, even in these times when it's been difficult for many health workers, you have reached out to many, and you are starting a revival even in the midst of health workers. Father, give them the strength that they need in order to press on, in order to break through. Give them the strength that they need. If my dear friend who's watching this video is a health worker, touch my dear friend and give my dear friend the strength and release the grace of healing over my dear friend. That wherever my dear friend will go, my dear friend will be able to pray boldly and not be afraid and be able to speak and help people and those people will be healed. In Jesus' name, amen. My dear friend, I bless you. I bless your family. May you be successful. May you be healed. May you be well. And may God give you progress. What is success? Success is accomplishing your purpose and your destiny. May God give you the grace and good health so that you can accomplish that purpose and that destiny that he has entrusted to you. In Jesus' mighty name, amen and amen. Until tomorrow, my dear friend, God bless you and goodbye. In saying that, my dear friend, we come to the end of this video. If you are blessed by this video and you feel led to donate or to partner with us to support us in this work that we are doing, then you can do so through PayPal or Patreon. All the links are provided in the description. Until next time, God bless you and goodbye.